Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. We're here by the river. I think it's just starting to spit a little bit of rain. But it's still a really nice morning. I'm here with Luna, my girl. There she is. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? I was just watching um, before I came on, there's trout in the river. It's quite hard to see them with all the overgrowth and reflections. There's quite a lot of trout in the river here. Swimming up and down. And just as I was going by there, I saw some eggs that had just hatched. I think it might have been some of the ducks here. There was three or four eggshells that had been hatched in a row. Um, quite big shells, so I think it was probably some of the waterfowl. Maybe hatched yesterday or last night. Looked pretty um, recent. But I'm going to take this along for a wee chat. And today I'm going to talk about... This is kind of be quite controversial I think to a lot of people but it's an important topic and it's something that I um, experienced myself and I've thought deeply about and it's forgiveness now if somebody um, hurts you or does something in your life not very good you know, you've heard that old saying. Oh, you need to learn to forgive. You need to forgive them and, and move on and let it go. Because if you don't forgive them, you'll only end up hurting yourself or you won't be able to uh, move on. Well, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with it at all. And I think... that if you've been forced or been made feel guilty to forgive someone that's harmed you physically, mentally or emotionally and you're not ready, it actually can work the other way. I've had times in my life where people have hurt me and I've been told the same story, just forgive them. Just let it go. But I've thought long and hard about this. And I came to the conclusion that if someone doesn't deserve your forgiveness, then why should we give it? Now, I'm not saying that you make that person's life chaos or you keep throwing it in their face every time you see them. Not at all. What I'm talking about is you taking control of the situation. You taking care of yourself. Doing whatever needs to be done to move out of that situation and away from it. And taking care of yourself. Forgiving yourself for your part that you might have played, whether knowingly or unknowingly. But if you do not want to forgive that person and you feel like you're not ready, you feel like maybe you'll never be ready, don't let anyone try to force you to forgive someone if they don't deserve it. And it's okay. Because sometimes people don't deserve it. Sometimes people do things to hurt us that are so bad. There's no way back from those things. 
and to excuse someone for their behaviour and for them to not take accountability for it is more detrimental to your own health. Now do everything you can to forgive yourself. But if you don't feel like you can forgive someone, no matter who it is, a sibling, a workmate, a long-standing friend, if that person has extremely distressed you, and they've not taken accountability for it, then don't forgive them. But don't ha hang in the anger and the, bitterment, the bitterness or resentment. Don't hold those things. Don't hold them in. Do what you need to do to heal, to learn from it and grow from it. But if you don't want to engage from that per with that person from that day on, you don't want to have anything more to do with them and you feel in your heart and soul that you either can't forgive them or you're not ready, then don't. It's as simple as that. You know, I've had people in my life that have hurt me really bad, really bad. And I just remove them from my life. I forgive myself, I heal myself. But I know from that moment forward, I don't want to ever have anything to do with that person again. Now I don't hold a grudge against them. I wouldn't do anything to harm them, but I don't forgive them. And I'm okay with that. Now there's been times where people do things unknowingly or they do them by mistake. That happens to all of us, you know, circumstances. And you get hurt. And you, they come to you and you talk to them about it. And, and that's fine. You resolve it. And you can forgive them. And that's okay. depending on what the situation is. But the main message is, don't let anyone force you or tell you that you need to forgive someone if you don't want to do it. It's okay. And you don't have to feel guilty about it. You just move, remove them from your life and get on with your own life. And you let it go that way. but you don't need to forgive them. All right, so from me and my beautiful girl, who's lying down here, we're gonna say ta-ta for now, and we'll catch you on the next one. Have a great day.